Finally, we've got all ourselves. <laughs> I mean, here you stand there. Hi, I'm Dale. And I, I'm Michael. And welcome to Spotted Motors. And welcome to <laughs> our first ever auction buy. Our first ever auction buy. Finally, won some at an auction. Yeah, yeah. That we didn't even go to. Yeah, yeah. Uh, we've got to do a big shout out to WB and Sons. They're a, a new uh, classic car auction house. Yes. Uh, based in Newcastle. Yeah, just over, just across the lot of the ones out in Newcastle. Yeah. Uh, we sold the car there when it very first started. We've been to three auctions now and come away empty handed every single time. Michael. <laughs> I sat at the computer this time, <laughs> I had a bit more success. <laughs> and we've, 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 we've bought a car that we both absolutely love. We've both had them in the past. Uh, and I think yeah. it, needs, it needs no introduction as a BMW E36. Uh, but this this model, this shape, we yeah. we've both haven't had this one. We've both haven't had this one, uh, and they're not that easy to come by now, are they? No, no. A, it is, and uh, you tell them what it's doing. It's, it's a compact, <laughs> it's a compact, it's got the stubby bum on it, and we are going to blame uh, Stephen Foster as well, who's got the M3 powered compact uh, as it sparked man and michael's interest back into the 36s oh, yeah. we loved it didn't we, we loved uh, about that car i mean this is a far cry from that car <laughs> but you've got to start somewhere don't you so uh, this is the uh, entry level isn't it it is the entry level it's a it's a 316 1.6 yeah uh, with an automatic transmission <laughs> <laughs> i've drove it home in the snow today and still can get it <laughs> just step out of line <laughs> which i was quite happy with because normally rear wheel drive Michael Castle, it's a. Uh, like you said before, uh, we've, had a both, we've both had a couple of these cars. Yeah. And I always remember my 1.6 going sideways more than it went uh, yeah. forwards, but that was a manual. Yeah, Michael had used to look out this window, he used to be up that window. <laughs> so, yeah, there you go. Uh, so, there you have it BMW 316i automatic compact. Uh, we absolutely love it, don't yeah, we? We do, so, yeah. about this one. Yeah, we're very, very, really pleased. So. I'll do the usual, I'll grab the camera, I'll show you around it, I'll show you the good bits, the bad bits, and the ugly bits. <laughs> hasn't got any ugly bits. No, just one, one slightly ugly bit. Oh, my, it looks so nice there. <laughs> oh. So, we'll start off with, uh, so we'll go straight on the back. Yeah. Let's have a look at the compact. Oh, I've, I've, I've bypassed the wing there. Like. So there you are, it is the compact, so uh, it's not the coupe. It's not the four door, it's not the touring, it is the compact. Uh, and it is definitely the bug standardish one, I'd say, because yeah. it has got the wheel trims. Uh, and it hasn't got the colour coded wings and stuff like that. Wing wears, sorry. But uh, yeah, we don't care. Look at that 316. I'm going to say, I don't think you can get a lesser number on the back of the 3 Series, especially <laughs> in E36. But uh, again, we just love it. Absolutely love it, don't we? Proper, proper happy with this one. So should we show the ugly bit first, and then that's the ugly, it. We don't mind. Let's get, let's get the ugly bit out of the way. Slight dent. <laughs> Slight. <laughs> <laughs> it's definitely had an incident with the fence post, hasn't it? Yeah, it's had an incident with somewhere. <laughs> but the good thing is, it hasn't affected the bonnet. It hasn't affected the door. Uh, and the bolt on wings are. Yeah, they? bolt on wings. I very much doubt we'll get one in this colour. Yeah. It doesn't matter, does it? We'll, yeah. we'll get one and we'll, we'll, we'll get somewhere near. And to our knowledge, compact wings are different to coupe. Yeah, and we do believe the compacts are different to coupe. Yeah. Are, are they the same as a four door? I don't know. We'll have to, we'll have to, uh, yeah. we'll have to ask. Well, like you said, they are bought on and they are available. Yeah, so, so nothing about these cars. Yeah. Like, so Euro and car parts, I think, stock them. Yeah, they're listed, aren't they? But Tons of other bits available for it as well, isn't it? Oh yeah, we can go crazy with this really. Uh, we are going to, well, I say we are going to, Michael's going to daily it for now. Uh, and who knows when our funds, I don't know, get a little bit more than what they are now because we haven't got anything. Uh, we would, I, I would like to straight six it and put a, a Chinese turbo on it. Michael, on the other <laughs> hand, uh, uh, would like to put an LS in it. <laughs> But uh, like we'll you get. Say, we better get by and sell them a few more first. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Stop keeping them as dailies. I know that's another <laughs> thing. Pop the bonnet, Mike. Let's have a look at the power plant before we uh, we have a look plant. in the the retro interior. 
Look at that thing, it just screams out 90s, doesn't it? The last of the proper BMWs is Yeah, the last of the proper BMWs, definitely. So there she is. In all its glory. I think 100 brake horsepower on the, on the dot. Feels like it's got about 10% of that left. Yeah, it's, <laughs> I think the automatic swallows quite a lot of that as well, the way yeah, it's geared it as well. But uh, it's very, very original, isn't it? It is. It's, it is. It I mean, it's, some, it's got all oh, this, it's a retro fit part and sensors on the back. Yeah, so that's, that's right. What that yeah. Uh, but other than that, it's, it is standard, isn't it? Yeah, so there's nothing to be messed about with it at all. We've looked at the service system, we think it's. Uh, been, it's, well, it has been well maintained. It has been well maintained. It's done 82,000 82, miles. Yeah. So it's not killed the miles. No. Like I say, it hasn't been messed with. So normally when they've been messed with, they had wheels put on them. Cut springs been, and all that stuff. Cut springs have been given a hard life. They drive like rubbish yeah. on yeah. Yeah. This drives like, it's just come out the showroom. It does. Honestly, yeah. it drives so straight. Yeah. So doesn't, there's no wheel wobbles or trip vibrations or knocks, bangs, shifts through the gears lovely. It does it drives with it, doesn't it? It's yeah. nice and quiet. Even the engine's nice, quiet, isn't it? You, do, you will make it a lovely daily. Yeah. Michael, <laughs> you've scored. <laughs> you've can, we buy, can we buy me a daily now? Yeah. <laughs> I'm sick of driving a Skoda estate. As long as it's not on an uh, Austin Allegro. <laughs> oh, well, uh, I think it might be fall out, Michael. <laughs> Go on, I'll let you do the honours opening the door. Beautiful. Oh, have you got a light? I have. Doesn't make much difference what until I climb in. Beautiful. Oh, Michael. <laughs> Proper 90s, like, spec, isn't it? Yeah, you know what absolutely. I mean? It's, uh, this one, electric windows, uh, electric mirrors. Well, it's hard to say what else it's got, isn't it, really, isn't it? <laughs> it yeah. hasn't got a radio that's been took out. Yeah, so we need to source a radio. So if anyone's got a radio, Standard hit. one would be nice, wouldn't it? Yeah, hit us up. Yeah, we like the nice standard one. Yeah. Uh, uh, this one as well doesn't have the uh, miles per gallon, instant miles per gallon reader. Yeah, they normally do, don't they? Uh, which is news to us because obviously we've had uh, coupes and four doors before, but it's it's wore so well a seat to, uh, you know, there's no splits or rips in them. Uh, look at the auto. Oh. <laughs> but yeah, I think you can tell we're super duper pleased. Absolutely. Overjoyed, in fact. <laughs> uh, Can't wait. Uh, do a few bits to it and uh, yeah, I think get it on the road. Moving forward, wing, and we might put a set of wheels on it, but we're not going to go daft. We're going to go no. standard. Standard, yeah. Uh, uh, so we're just going to keep it. Yeah. Maybe put our put our put our badge on it. Put our yeah. On it, yeah. Which we've never done. We've never kept anything really, and uh, so. We're going to have this, we're going to have the convertible almost now, which is going to be around for a while. Yeah. So we're not doing too bad. Yeah. There's a daily each, we'll just keep swapping them. Oh, well, yeah, we keep swapping them. <laughs> it depends what the, if the sun's shining and that. So. <laughs> awesome, mate. So, yeah, I'll put the camera down with all of you for saying goodbye. And, uh, yeah, hope everyone likes the BMW. Let us know what you think. Straight six or LS. <laughs> <laughs> Our first successful. Uh, Walking by and we're absolutely over the moon with it. Yeah. From picking it up today and driving it home, uh, big smile on my face. Yeah. To, to now when we look around it tonight, we're not disappointed at all, are we? No, far from it. In fact, and uh, I think again, we'd just like to voice a, 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 a thank you to WB and Sons for all the hard work that they do put in because uh, I think the three auctions or four auctions deep now and. Uh, yeah, it's, they're, it's, a, they're a crap bunch of lads, aren't they? Yeah, it's uh, grown and grown. Yeah, dead friendly, yeah. helpful. So, yeah, know what we're talking about as well, which they're not, mm. they're not silly. Yeah. Uh, which helps. Uh, yeah, but like I say, the next job for this is it is an MOT, so yeah. we'll stick an MOT on it, see if, see if it needs any work for that. Uh, we'll go from there, basically. Yeah. So we, think... have, we have any use it between us, yeah. really. Definitely put a few shows in it, what have you. Yeah. Uh, yeah. So I think radio, MOT, radio wheels. Yeah, MOT, now. radio wheels for now. Yeah. Uh, we'll talk this way out. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, definitely sort that out. Uh, but yeah, that's about it, isn't it? So there you go. BMW, BMW E36, me and Michael are absolutely... We'll cool. be having it on. We are going to keep this one. We yeah, have we to. Have. So we have to. You can't get it. No, no, that's <laughs> the thing, isn't it? Like The prices of the coupes have gone stupid. Yeah. Tourings are just ridiculous. So yeah. if you want a four-door, you know... Or if you want a part extra tourings, 
Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> if, you, if you like, if you like, because uh, we'd love a tour. Yeah, we'd, we'd swap for a tour. So yeah, just let us know. You know, we're happy. <laughs> but we are keeping it. <laughs> Right, right, no, I think we'll wrap up. Oh, and also, uh, I should always say this, but we never ever do, do we? Uh, hit subscribe if you if you yeah, like what you're saying. You want to see where we're going with it and all and stuff like that and all. But uh, you know, you know, you don't need it all. <laughs> saying that, so, so there, there you go. Anyway, uh, I always forget what we say now. Tell me when did. Oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks very much for watching. That's it. We've been spotted motors. <laughs>